Hello ugly bitches. So I'm brand new with a brand new video. And I guess what it is. Story time motherfuckers. So I know I look like I would never work at a place like Walmart. But yes bitch. I used to work at that place. I got fired from that place too. So basically my story behind that is I used to work at Walmart when I was in need of money and cash. And basically I didn't like it. Like it was not trying to knock down, I mean, I feel like it was just the people that made it bad. Like, it was just really bad. Like, oh, fuck the, fuck the bitches. And, um, oh, and, and, I, and some of y'all may already know this story, but you know what? Who, and bitch, I needed a video this week, and so this is gonna be the video. So basically, I used to work at Walmart. I worked there for like four or five months, and at the time, I was trying to be a Viner. And, you know, I was trying to come up on social media and trying to be, trying to put out funny Vine and stuff, and really, that place was really just irking my tits. My tits were as red, itchy, inflamed. I, they will call me on my weekend when I'm trying to suck a dick and they be like, can you come into work? <laughs> Bitch, what? I would try to be like, milk a titty. <laughs> can you come to work? <laughs> Bitch, what? Like, they will always try to call me in for some blame ass excuse that this bitch done ran away from home and we they, we don't know where she is so she can't come to work. Now we gotta get you. And honestly, my bomb ass fucking marketing skills, I was always selling the shoe. I was in the shoe department because a bitch stay fabulous and I know a style. So basically, they always always some bullshit. They will always tell me that I was too slow sometimes that my cash register, I will always get the wrong change. I will always, I forgot to close the bananas, 4011. Oh, I think that's actually what's it called, 4011 or 2011, some shit like that. And I would just, they would always try to tell me something. So I was, you know, fed up with the job. So I went on Vine and, you know, it was 11 o'clock. It's a 24 hour Walmart because where I live, there's a lot of people that like to, you know, that we need a 24 hour Walmart shit with the people. No shade, no shade. Um, and it was like 11 o'clock at night, and you know, I'm like, you know what, do I really need this job? Like, do I really need a... Welcome to Walmart, how can I help you? Of course, let's find your $2 shoes right here. Thank you very much. Do I really need to do that? Mm. So I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm about to make a vine. So you know the song? Fuck it up, fuck it up, don't give a shit anymore. So I had that song playing, and tell me how I was in the, I went in the shoe department. I clocked out, you know, I went, swipe, bitch, I'm not on the clock anymore. I'm not getting paid, so guess what? I'm a free man. And I ran down that shoe hall like, I'm gonna fuck it on, fuck it on, don't give a shit anymore. And then I got up on the table and threw a fucking chair. Now, I didn't know, I didn't throw it out of the bitch. I just threw it, like, at the floor. It made a couple of loud sounds. So I'm like, you know, I put the video up, it got like 40,000 views, and I had off the next two days. And tell me how I come back to work and all I see is this. I'm thinking all these fat bitches looking at me like if I'm a piece of fucking cake. Bitch, why are y'all looking at me? Why are y'all staring at me? Bitch, I know I look good. I know my dick look big. I know my titties look perky. Y'all need to quit fucking staring at me like that. Like y'all a bunch of hyenas that haven't been fed. Actually, no, y'all look like y'all been fed a lot, honey. <laughs> Clogged arteries. And, you know, they all looking at me, and I keep asking them to ask my friend, like, why the fuck are these ugly bitches looking at me? Like, don't they got fucking st uh, shelves to stock? And then my friend tells you, why'd you post that video? And I said, ooh, one video, they're like, the one where you were throwing shit. And I'm like, mm -hmm. all y'all little ugly bitches know about that? They're like, yeah, it's all over Facebook. But they're all tagging each other. They're tagging the store now. And I'm like, mm -hmm. shit, I hope management don't know about it. So I'm working this shit. And all I hear is, attention, Walmart, ass attention, Attention Walmart Associates, can we please have Christian from Shoes to the manager's office? Can we please have Christian from Shoes to the manager's office? Peep how I just did that shit. Mm -hmm. I used to do that too at Walmart. I used to be the loudspeaker person. Mm -hmm. It was my flawless voice up in that bitch. And they call me over to the management office and I'm like, uh, bitch, am I about to get a promotion? Like, am I about to get upgraded? Am I about to be moved to another area at Walmart? Like, I just didn't think they would catch that, like, video. Because it was only two days from the video. So I just didn't think they actually saw it. I came in that bitch. And that ugly ass Candy, her name was Candy, but it looked like sour cream, bitch. She was like, do you know why you're in here for? And I'm like, no. I mean, you didn't tell me on the loudspeaker the reason. So I'm here right now. What's up? And she's like, you know what you did. And I'm like, boosted the sales? Yeah, I know I did that, girl. Check the charts, honey. I done boosted. Like every other weekend I work here with my flawless young looking skin. 
She's like, no, we saw what you did. We saw the video. Did you really think you were not going to get away with this? You would do that. You just, you know what? You just, you just degraded this company. We gave you, we gave you employment. People would, people, we have people lined up for your job. And I'm like, bitch, I'm getting paid minimum wage. You better relax, honey. You need to pick up your titties from the floor, honey. They're too saggy. Why well, your name is Candy, bitch, but you look like a fucking spoiled ass sour cream. Bitch, sit down. And it's just like, and then I was like, and then I was like, I mean, and then I said, I mean, I was gonna like leave anyway. She's like, do you hate your job? And I'm like, I don't hate it, but I mean, I have to leave regardless for college. She's like, you just lost a great opportunity. And frankly, we could call the cops or vandalism. I'm like, I picked the shoes up and I didn't hurt a bitch. So you need to relax. Like, y'all need to relax. But I mean, I, I'm talking like this right now, but low key, I was in the office like, <gasps> okay. And basically they fired me and they took my, they took my badge away. They took my ugly ass, raggedy ass vest away. They took my discount card, which I was ready to punch her dead in her titties because that was 10% off. And that was really helpful for me, bitch. I'm broke. And yeah, that's basically how I got fired. And then they told me I can never come back to that Walmart because if I ever stepped foot in that Walmart and acted a scene, I would get the cops called on me and all this shit. And you know, fuck all those ugly bitches. So basically that was my story time video and I hope y'all enjoyed it. Like this video, share a video, subscribe, I don't know, all that shit. My Instagram is at Christian Oliveros. My Twitter is at J-U-S-T-M-E Christian, a.k.a. Just Me Christian. My Snapchat is at Christian Oliveira because the S cannot fit. Just like your daddy cannot fit in my asshole. Um, what other social media is there? My Facebook, Christian Oliveros. I think that's it. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching my video and hope y'all enjoyed my story. Wow.